whenever we are seeing the software in terms of states then we will be using this state transition testing design technique here transition states between the one state to another and here also the inputs whatever the inputs we try to give based on that input or events it get triggers to the another state or it gets triggered to the another state transition whenever that kind of situation in any application then we will be using this state transition testing if you are taking this example we have an uh, ATM is there. We have a ATM machine is there in the ATM machine. So we will be inserting the card whenever we are inserting the card then it waits for a pin when you enter the pin if it is in the first ray the whatever the pin the person enter if that is correct then you will get the access to the account if is the first attempt fail then it will give again the second attempt as well and in the second attempts if is able to successfully enter the right pin then still the application or ATM will be providing access to that person even the second attempt also if he is not successful then it will it will allow to give a third try even in the third attempt also if he gets his pin okay then the access will be provided even with the third try also if that uh, person is not successful then that ATM should take that uh, card and it should uh, not allow that person to take that card from the ATM this is kind of a recommend here if you can uh, see right if any kind of uh, flow happens here a sequence of flows happens and sequence of events happen sequence of inputs happen and each event or each input triggered to the another uh, state here if any applications having this kind of uh, recommends then definitely we should adopt state transition testing technique